I wonder where you are. I wonder if you think about me once upon a time in your wildest dreams. You wonder where your commissions went. You wonder where the old programs that you thought were not there anymore are now there available just right for lending out to the borrowing community. Loan officers, this is your chance to rise like the phoenix. What that means is sometimes pieces go down to ashes and out comes this beautiful, majestic, powerful being. And I believe there's many loan officers that do not understand the value within their zip code that this lending industry that has brought you to this podcast to tell you that Wall Street has a demand and you can be the face of that demand to supply it to your town, to your zip code. Today we had the opportunity to speak to Rudy Orman at non-QM. We talked that there was $400 million a month at non-QM. However, if you take into consideration that, that, that it's almost 20 times the amount of originations in the agency space, we're talking about billions of dollars of Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac loans, and non-QM is just a small amount. And yet the profits are much larger. Rudy talked about how you don't sell with your own wallet, meaning don't be afraid to sell something that I wouldn't buy. Whether it's, I can't afford a Rolls Royce, so that person can't afford, or I would never pay for a piece of art that looks like someone threw paint against the wall. So that person wouldn't. It doesn't apply and it shouldn't apply here. You don't need to make the decisions for them. You need to understand that in your market, there are real estate investors that know how to play this game and they're going to the wrong resources. I am so excited that Mike and I are going to begin working on different podcasts to help loan officers in their area see how powerful these programs are. Don't make your income your wildest dreams. In fact, make it your reality by bringing non-QM back into your origination platform. The business is crazy right now, the origination business. And if you're not you know, offering all products, you're gonna lose business. You're gonna lose your core business. But also, if you're not thinking out of the box, you're probably never gonna grow your business, right? Non-QM is not a written term refi product. It's, it's purchase or cash out. What do you need the money for? And how can I help you get the money? Yeah, interest rates are always gonna ask about interest rates. They're gonna be higher than agency rates because that's the market. So what's the purpose? Be curious, ask the questions for the consumer. Not all of them are gonna buy it. Some are gonna push back on you, right? But a lot of them will understand what you're trying to do. You're trying to help them get money that maybe a lot of people would not lend that because of their situation. Because they own a lot of properties. They are real estate investors. They are, they do get paid differently and they don't show their income like, you know, Feeny Me, Freddie Mac guidelines want them to, right? Be confident, understand the programs. There's a lot of non-QM people like NQM funding out there. We'll help you, we'll give you the training. We'll stand by your side. We'll help you structure the deal. So you do your part, you reach out to Rudy, you get these programs ready, because we learned today, yes, you can cut cost, cut cost, cut cost, but why not raise revenue?